well. I can't wait. I'm expecting beer. Beer, lagers. Do they have to assemble their own drinks? Well, if they're cocktails, yes. True. Yeah, there you go. I think there's probably going to be a blonde beer. Mm -hmm. There has to be spirit, surely. Ah, yeah, they have to vodka. have vodka. Something along those lines. I hear Swedish vodka is meant to be pretty good. Absolute. Yeah, but like the beyond absolute, like there's other ones. Why would you need something else when absolute is everything? Sofiro. I think it's beer. I don't know why, but when I see those two colors, I always think it's going to be a blonde. I don't know yeah. why. I can feel my healthcare system and social services increasing by holding this can. I'm so gosh darn mad. Ah, Jesus, James. Sorry, I poured that arseways. My bad. I forgot that beer has the foam part. It smells fantastic. It smells really nice. I, I wish I could tell without all this foam on it. Yeah, so it smells like beer to me. Oh, my lipstick. I didn't even drink it and I got lipstick on the glass. There's fruit in it, right? Mm. Are you getting a fruit? Uh, mm. Much like this video, there's fruit in it. Oh, God, cheers. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's so good. That's so smooth. I'm a non-beer drinker and this is actually nice. I mean, there's nothing distinct about it is the only thing I'll say. Like, yeah. There's no standout. Yeah, yeah. It's like, oh, beer, but like, I'm not going to taste that and be like, oh, that's a Sephiro if ever I yeah. tasted one. God, yeah, you could drink this all day. Yeah, that's so light. Pity it comes in such a small can. Do we need to make reference to the fact that you're wearing a very Swedish-inspired hairstyle. Again! I, I just knew that the Swedes would want me to make the effort. Blondes aren't more fun. I find reds are. Mm. Oh, that's a nine. That's high, yeah, it's, it's high in the scale. It's nicer than most of the beers you can buy here. <laughs> I take this stock home. I really like the look of that can. Ooh. Our Boga Stark Oil. This is 7.3. Oh, the wow. last one was 5.2. It's very Swedish looking. Yeah, I like it. I swear this is mine. No! <laughs> no! No, James, leave it. God damn it. See, mom says you have to give it to me. Skull. Skull. Mmm. Oh, yeah. absolutely. fucking lootly. No. I'd prefer that because there's more flavour on it. There's a bit of life, a bit of character. I can taste artificial flavours, but there's no artificial sweeteners. Ah, he likes it. So heavy. Oh, I love it. I think it's so good. It smells like piss. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> oh, it actually does. And I'm, people say that about beer all the time. It actually smells like urine. It's like, I hate that. It's like, um, I don't know, it's just more full bodied or more just, just, just taste your all around. It looks like a oh. lager, but it tastes like a stout kind of thing. Yeah, it has the consistency of a Guinness. You know what? This is a sweet dish. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, girl. <laughs> Which is much like the Swedes in general. There's not much. I don't know anything about them really. Yeah, yeah. It's just very like I want to know more. Yeah, it's there, it's, and you know something. it's there. Yeah. Just give me something <laughs> more. <laughs> Considering I gave the last one a six, <clears throat> and it had five percent, this one is seven point three percent. So I'm far more on board. Because uh, it's going to get you where you need to go quicker. So I would give that about seven and a half. Yeah. I can't fault them on their beer. I enjoyed this beer. But also, I have no sense of taste in any sense of the word. Bring on the spirits. Yes! Vodka! Yes! <laughs> yes! Um, is that absolute vodka is not Swedish. I refuse to believe this. It's not Swedish. I did not know this was Swedish. Swedish vodka. Look, it says it right on the top. Which... Well, it actually says Swedish vodka right on it. <laughs> Look, and then it says on the bottom, produced in Sweden. I've never noticed that now. See, you're too busy drinking it all these years and I never rushed down to read it. Little mm. mm. Swedish notes off it. The thing is, I have a love-hate relationship with vodka in that uh, I hate it and I don't know why I put the word love in there. That vodka. is beautiful. As vodka goes, it's very smooth. Ah, yeah, that's vodka. Yeah. God, this tastes like nothing. This is so that's easy to drink. I know it's good. I will say, that's not the worst vodka I've ever drank straight. No. Did you know that Sweden is the largest northern country of Europe? I didn't know that. Yeah, there you go. Thank you. This would be lovely with a 7 Up now. If you had actually given me a 7 Up, I would drink that whole thing and I would be very happy about it. All that's missing is maybe a couple of ice cubes and us being on a beach. Is it whiskey? It's whiskey! Yay! I hate vodka. Love whiskey. I don't like whiskey. It's beautiful. Ooh, nice bottle. This is 
stunning. They love their clear bottles now for spirits. You can see what you're getting. Right now, ready? I'm ready for some Irish ASM ASM or Wow. Oh, it's a 10 year old single malt. But I look cool. Irish whiskey is a mix of malted and unmalted barley, so this is different. It's just malt. 46 percent. Smells very low chain. 46. Mm. Generally, whiskey, depending on how many times it's distilled, tells you how many times it's been placed in different barrels. This is only single distills. This is going to be a very strong taste. Uh, yeah, this is 46.1. The go. more distillation, the lower percentage it gets as well. <coughs> Ooh. <coughs> Oh, that's good. Oh, oh my God. Can you feel the fire? Yeah. Oh my God, my stomach's on fire. Divine. Yeah. That is a strong whiskey, but a good whiskey. Imagine taking a whiteboard marker, screwing the bottom off, pulling the whole inkwell out and just going, Ugh. I actually find that easier than the whiskey shoot we did of all the Irish ones. I find that a little easier to drink. This is delicious. But that's I the fucking that love. Whiskey. I give it a zero out of you ten. You give it a zero? Yeah. Oh no, this is my favorite of the ones we've tried so far. So do you give it a ten? I give it a ten. I give it a ten. But I, it's just drinking it straight. Like I would love a hot whiskey right now. This one is a little bit harsher, but I think because it's a bit harsher, you're just gonna drink it straight anyway. You're gonna, you're just gonna be like, well, look, this, this is a strong whiskey. I'm gonna knock her back straight because she jizzes. That's how she's made. She's made for straight drinking. She's not made for no ginger ale or no lime. Absolutely, it's my favorite vodka. Yeah. But that's a nice whiskey. Finishing on a high. With some <sighs> delicious 10 year whiskey. We yeah. like Sweden. Yeah. Well done, Sweden. Like, yeah. we thought we were good at making alcohol. Like, Sweden are pretty good, too. Fine bunch of lads, the Swedes. Sure, they know how to make a few drinks. Sure, they do. I wonder all the Swedish thing. people are going to be like, what? Why did you pick did those four? Yeah, yeah, There's so much more exciting alcohol that we had. Mm. The best one's obviously Absolute. The whiskey's cool. Me and that whiskey would be best pals. Me and that whiskey would, you know, live together maybe. And potentially, if things were going okay, I might introduce them to my parents. And if you know what, down the line, we felt like buying a house together, we'll see if we can get a mortgage. But mortgage approval is very hard to come by these days. But sure, look, we'll see what happens. It's early days yet. Subscribe, click the bell. The bell is over there. Oh my God, we're in a really small box right now. What happened? Why did we get smaller? Colin. Colin, but help. the bell's over there, so if you click it. Colin, I, I can't drink my drink in this confined space. Take the bell to make our faces bigger.